uh, I have this, I have this like weird, um, controversial, like fascination recently involving robotics, um, and uh, colonialism. Interesting. Uh, yeah, and it's it's very it's it's not very academic. I, I'm just kind of like very. How can that not be academic? <laughs> like, <laughs> okay. I mean, it is, but like I haven't been like really diving into it. Oh, but, I got um, you. I got, it's pre-academic. Yeah, like I haven't really like bought books or like read like a lot of it has to do with media. So I haven't really been watching movies about it and stuff. Yeah. Um, but there's definitely a very different view of robotics in Japan versus like the U.S. Huh. or Western world. Because um, in Japan, it's it's more about like a human esque. Like Japan's a very rigid society, and robots are there to kind of like humanize people in a weird way. Wait, like a lot of the. A lot of Japanese media, like we're talking like old, like fifties. So, so, so my my my, uh, my my time reference is is like post World War Two. Got it. Okay. Uh, so for 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 Japan, it was a, this weird. Um, Wait, so robots were part of Japanese culture in like post World War Two. Oh yeah, I did not know that. Okay, that's wild. Um, trying to think, like, what's it called? The Atom Boy. Did you ever watch that? Or not yet? Uh, it was a black it. and white like. Yeah. I mean, uh, um, but it was about it's kind of Mega Man. Like, I feel like Mega Man was based on it, but it's about this yeah. like professor who like creates this Mega boy. Uh, he couldn't have his he couldn't have a kid of his own, so he built a robot kid, and this robot kid kind of just embodies like childhood. Huh. But he's also a superhero. Interesting. So he's off like saving the world, but he's he's a very much like a a, a very innocent like kid. Um. Like another Japanese anime is uh, Doraemon, which is a um, name for the It's like this robot cat from the future. <laughs> That's cool. Um, who goes back in time and he's like super lazy and just like not. But you know, he, he's just this, this big, cute robot. That but is, I mean, like, given the theme in Atom Boy, I'm guessing he probably also has some kind of superhuman abilities or like. Yeah, he flies and like shoots lasers. But like. Yeah. But in a very like. But he does everything in a very childish way, you know? Yeah. Um, and I feel like it's it's a lot of like Japan trying to embrace like vulnerability after World War Two. 